All right, we're gonna shoot uh, five, or, I'm sorry, four or five shot groups. We shoot standard SK. Um, we're gonna shoot four groups out of the CZ 457 and then uh, four groups out of the uh, 1022. Shot a couple Fowlers down range already. So let's uh, see what it'll do. All right, top row CZ. Wasn't too pretty, but let's see what we got. Wow, starting off in that same spot. like it's starting to tighten up last two Better. I'll bring it left to click. All right, last group for the CZ. Alright, that looked better. I did just clean it last night. So I shot a 10 rounds off camera. Looked pretty tight. Clearly I probably should have shot some more. Alright, so we're going to set up the uh, 1022. We'll do 10 uh, or 4 5 shot groups with the 1022 SK Standard Plus. Be right back. Now we got the uh, 1022 all set up. Shot a couple Fowlers down there. Hopefully the group will look better than those Fowlers did. But, here we go. First group. Alright, that looked pretty good. Let's go to the second group. Whoa. Not a bad group, but... grouping you know <laughs> not in the same spot all right last two groups
Wow, threw one. <laughs> Looked in group, then threw one. Well, I've definitely seen this gun shoot better. Um, I did just get the trigger back from Timony. The, uh, the uh, safety broke on it and it was set for like two and a half pounds. It's supposed to be between one and a half and two coming from the factory. Uh, so I'm gonna have to check the torque. On the chassis here, this one I torqued it down to 28 inch, or 20, yeah, 20 inch pounds. Uh, maybe I'll bump it up to 30 and see uh, see if that makes. Sense. Thanks for watching.